Valentine's Day is just around the corner. Whether love is on the brain or you've just had one bad date after another, you won't want to miss this show. Cornstock Theater is gearing up for their production of the musical First Date. And today we have a couple of the actors joining us. We have Trisha Bagby and Ricky Hawkins. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Glad to have you both here. So first, can you give us a little background on the show for those who aren't familiar? Uh, sure. Well, the show is called First Date, and it's uh, just what it sounds like. Okay. It uh, is a story revolving around uh, this couple that is on a blind date and the kind of awkwardness and uh, the way that, you know, it just goes with being on a date in the modern world. Very good. And can you tell me how many people are working on this show and what it's been like working with such a tight-knit cast? Yeah, we have a cast of seven. Oh. Um, and then we have, you know, the choreographer, um, a couple people on the tech crew. Um, and working with only seven people in the cast has been pretty great. Um, I'm, I'm sure you've also been part of much bigger casts and just kind of getting to know everyone and having such like an intimate show, you know, where everyone doesn't really leave the stage and we're all kind of involved with the, each other all the time. Knowing people as the people as well as their characters really helps uh, to go with that while you're on stage. And speaking of the tight-knit cast, what is it like to play multiple parts throughout this musical? How many parts are you guys playing here? Uh, so we actually play a couple that is also on a date. Okay. Um, but then we switch back and forth between being uh, one of the lead's uh, best friends, being an ex-boyfriend, so going back and forth. Uh, yeah. Trisha here plays one of the lead's sisters. Okay. Um, and then the other lead's mother. So it's, it's, it's fun because the challenge is trying to make each individual character an individual and right. not just being the same for each role that you're playing. So how does that kind of work for you? Like how do you get into character? How do you just take on these different roles? Yeah, the, I think the text really lends itself to each different character. Uh -huh. Some of them are very like zany and wacky and there for the laughs. And some of them are kind of these more serious moments in the show where, you know, one of these characters is going to make you cry laughing, and then a few minutes later, another character is going to make you cry out of emotion. So uh, really kind of playing that kind of thing up and um, thinking about who this character is right. and seeing how you can portray that in just, you know, the three minutes that you have to be that character. Absolutely. So obviously lots for the audience to look forward to and we want people to come out and support you all. So can you give us the details about how people can get tickets, the when, the where, all of those great details? Uh, yeah, so you can uh, buy tickets in our box office. I think our hours are uh, 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. Uh, or you could go to uh, cornstocktheater.com. Uh -huh. uh, the dates are this weekend and next weekend, February 10th and 11th and the uh, 17th and 18th at 7.30 p.m. and then this and next Sunday at 2.30. Very good. Well, all of those details were right there on your screen. Trisha and Ricky, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And of course, we will share all of those details up on our website. That's CIProud.com.